Hello, fabulous people. I am Donietta. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Dietta, where we discuss all things fabulous. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you the scoop on my top five. Yes, I said five favorite red lips. So if you guys know anything about me, you guys know I love me a red lip, baby. A red lip is my favorite. It is my staple. It is tried and true. And I've been meaning to do this video for a while. And what better time as we enter into fall, red, like jewel tones, and let's get it popping, okay? So I know I've been gone for a minute. It's probably been about a month around Labor Day since I posted a video. I was just out here, you know, trying to make sure that I balanced everything that I had going on, you know, like keep the plate spinning. So on top of all the personal travel that I do, you guys have seen the blogs and I'm always out and about. I've started traveling again for work post COVID. I've also resumed the podcast that I have, Lay Twins Experience with my twin, who's not really my twin. And so just making sure that I can keep cranking out good content for you all, but also keep all of the other things that I have going on. You know up and afloat so i know i was gone for a minute but now i'm back with the jump off i think that's how the lyric go if not we just did a remix okay so now that we got all those housekeeping uh items out of the way i want to say welcome if you are a new viewer i hope that you enjoy your time here if you have not already please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and when you subscribe don't forget to turn on those notifications so that you will never miss the upload of a new and fabulous video if you are a return viewer i appreciate you thank you for rocking with me i also want to say that since i've been gone you guys i reached 500 subscribers like now we're well over 500 and that's a big deal like 500 might not seem like a lot of subscribers to you all but it really is a big deal to me i appreciate each and every one of you thank you thank you thank you thank you mama we made it i know i said we were done with the housekeeping items but i got one more if you don't already, head on over to Instagram and follow me. I am Dietta there as well. If you already follow me, then you know that I have been alive and well because I post in real time on Instagram. And so that's just another, you know, way to keep in touch with me and I can keep in touch and engage with you all outside of YouTube because that is real time life. Um, or at least I try to keep it as real time as possible. Whereas the content here on YouTube, it sort of kind of lags a little bit, but you know, I'm all, I might not be on time, but I ain't never late. Is that what they said? You know, mm -hmm. I'm going to go through these in no particular order. Um, so they're all my fave. I rotate through all five of these throughout the year. This previous year 2020 with the start of COVID I did start dipping and dabbing into wearing other shades <laughs> other than red but red is my tried and true it is my staple um red is actually my favorite color and so I have more red lipsticks than probably your average person I am going to only give you five um maybe later I'll give you <laughs> some of the other 100 million that I have in my arsenal of red lips so the lip stain that I'm wearing now is Morphe. Can you guys see that? And the name of the cuddler is Bloodshot. You guys, I just discovered this. I would say in the last couple of months, Monroe still um, talked about it on her YouTube channel. And I really, really like the color on her. And so I went to Ulta, I believe is where I got this one and picked it up. I didn't try a sample. I just knew I wanted it. And I am like absolutely positively in love. What I love about this is it has lasting power. I can put this on. I can go out to dinner. I can have drinks. And if it's not on on, it is at least 90% still on. Um, as you can tell, this is a deeper red. It is more of a burgundy color. Um, it goes on very easily. And like I said, it has long lasting power. My lips don't feel dragged, dry, dragged, dry or cracked as the day or the night goes on when I wear this. And sometimes that can be a problem with lip stains. But if we're going to talk about lip stains, like Morphe is probably one of my favorite overall. And then this bloodshot color, but it gives what needs to be gave or gave what needs to be given. Whatever them children be saying, child, you know. Auntie can't keep up with everything. Number two on my top five favorite lips is something that I discovered, I would say at the end of 2019, right before the world blew up. And it is the lip bar and the shade is Boss Lady, B-A-W-S-E, 
boss. And so a soror of mine actually rocks a red lip like no other. And I noticed that she wore a particular red lip that just caught my attention. So I texted her and I asked her um, what it was after I saw her post a picture on Facebook. And sure enough, it was the lip bar. And she said, boss lady. And so I got this and I have not looked back. I really, really like it. Um, I like actually, when I do venture into other colors, the lip bar is gonna be the brand that I, I'm gonna go for. I probably have about eight to 10 of their lip stains. This has lasting power. It is very affordable. You can find it at Target. You can find it at Walmart. Um, sometimes throughout the year, they'll have a sale where there'd be a discount on the overall price of their lip stains or um, free shipping, things of that nature. So the lip bar is tried and true for me. It is one of my faves. And you know what? I have a discount code. I was going to almost forget. My bad discount code i'll put it below in the description as well as i'll put it here on the screen it is d at a d y e t t a and i do believe that'll get you 10 percent off okay you guys are going to notice a pattern here <laughs> this is going to be the third lip stain <laughs> so i'm a big fan of lip stain lipstick i like lip stains because i feel like the pigmentation in it is a lot richer, is a lot deeper. I feel like it clings to my lip a lot better. And what I mean by cling is it has lasting power. I can eat, I can drink, I can talk, and I don't have to constantly be reapplying my, my lip throughout the day. And so number three on this list is Too Faced. This is their Melted Matte. <laughs> the name of the color, y'all, is Lady Balls. <laughs> <laughs> lady balls you heard me correctly this is a brighter red than the mm, first two and it's probably going to be the brightest out of the five as you can see um i like this one i also get a lot of compliments i actually wore this i believe for one of the first times would have been in my 40th birthday shoot photo shoot that i did back in april I always get a lot of compliments whenever i wear this one I don't even remember how I stumbled upon it. I just honestly don't remember, but I do remember like scrolling through Instagram and looking for the hashtag like Too Faced and then Lady Balls and seeing how the the pigmentation showed up on different skin tones. And then specifically, I was looking for something closer to my skin tone. And let me tell y'all, I saw that nary picture out there on the world wide web of somebody wearing this and it did not look good it is a striking color it is bold it is bright and if you want to turn some heads lady balls is gonna turn some heads awesome awesome product this is what all of these if they ever stop making this i'm gonna die i'm not gonna die but i'm gonna cry i really will all right, we are up to number four on the list. And number four is actually going to be a lipstick. So let's see. I really love the packaging on this one too. So this is Pat McGrath. And the type of lip that it is is Elson and the shade is 003. So first and foremost, the packaging and the presentation is probably the prettiest of all of the, the lipsticks, lip stains that I have. I just love this little case. Um, it made me feel a lot better about purchasing it. This is the most expensive <laughs> um, in the five today. All of the other ones I will say are below $15. So even though this is a lipstick, like y'all, first of all, it glides on like velvet. This will be closer in shade to um, a more true red, not necessarily a deeper, darker burgundy type red. So I would put this in the same family proximity to the the Too Faced lip stain, the Lady Balls. But I sometimes put this on, especially like when I'm doing Zoom meetings at home for work and I just wanna throw on a lip and this literally will like carry through with me for most of the work day. It doesn't stick on as much as a lip stain would do, but for a, a lipstick, tried and true, um, I have no complaints about it. 
lipstick can be a little tricky like when you order it you don't know how the shade is going to look when you get it and with this one i absolutely positively was not disappointed like i said i have no complaints with this the packaging is beautiful it really does glide on like velvet like sometimes i just do it slow because it feels so good we have come to my number five and my top five favorite lips say that fast five times <laughs> And we are back with another lip stain. This is the Sephora Liquid Lip Stain. The color is Cherry Moon. The number is 94. You guys, I used to wear this every single day at one point. I didn't care if I was going um, to work, on a date, on vacation. This was like... If you could wear something in the ground, I wore this below the ground. I actually was at an optometry appointment, you know, trying to get, make sure my vision was on point, getting my contacts and my glasses for the year. And one of the techs who was doing a part of my eye exam had on this red lip and I said, ma'am, what is that? And she told me, and when I tell you, I broke my neck and went down to Sephora and I hadn't looked back since. It was one of the best decisions I've ever made. So this is another one that I always get a lot of compliments on. It is a deeper, darker red. It's not as dark as this one, but a few, a few doors down <laughs> in the shade category. You're going to get a lot of compliments when you wear it. Like people literally always ask me, whether it be in the comments on Instagram or in person, like what is this lip that I have on? And it's Sephora brand, great quality, very affordable. Obviously, you can get it at Sephora. So tried and true. But this is probably the one that I've worn the most. The others, not so much just because, you know, COVID and quarantine. But if I were out in the streets, all five of these would be in heavy rotation. Well, that brings this to an end. Those were my top five favorite red lips. I hope that you found the video helpful. Let me know if you have tried any of the lips lippies lip stains lipstick that i showed in today's video if you tried the particular shade that i showed you in today's video and what you thought about it um and if you haven't go out and get it because let me tell you you cannot go wrong with a red lip honey tried and true if you haven't already please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and when you subscribe don't forget to turn on those notifications so that you will never miss the upload of a new and fabulous video also don't forget to head on over to instagram and follow me there as well i am dieta on instagram and there you'll get real-time updates of this fabulous ride that i call life don't forget that in the description, I will put the discount code to the lip bar. It is Dieta. I do believe that you get 10% off with that. Show this video to your friends. We Just because we love hot girl summer does not mean that we still not going to be out here and being hot girls with fabulous red lips, you guys. I love you. I appreciate you. I will see you next time. And until then, be fabulous.